tractor trailer and a CSX freight train happened uh, just before uh, 6 o'clock this morning in Yardley, right along Big Oak Road, right where it crosses over uh, the railroad tracks there. And this truck uh, was pushed about a half a mile before the train was able to come to a complete stop. The white stuff you see on the front of the train and truck, uh, that's foam. Uh, from the firefighters and also most likely cement uh, dust because that's what that truck uh, was filled with concrete uh, you know the concrete mix and look how far back a good half a mile where they made impact at the railroad crossing which by the way has gates has lights um, I think I did see the gate down um, yep it is down on the left hand side there I can see it and all that white is all foam all over the roadway uh, because they were concerned about a brush fire which caught right there in that corner. So let's go to the maps. Here's what the intersection looks like. Big Oak Road and the railroad tracks. And that's a shot of what the truck looked like before it got smacked by that freight train and pushed all the way down the line. Now, this is a, a stretch of tracks that used, is used by SEPTA's West Trenton Regional Rail Line. Service suspended there. Some trains are originating out of Neshaminy. Also, the Neshaminy School District sent out a note um, expecting delays because that's a busy intersection uh, to get across.